So I know that um, we know who you are, sir. But for those watching, uh, I wouldn't mind a uh, formal introduction. We'll start with you, sir, with your name and your title, of course, okay. and yours too, sir. His Royal Highness is a victor. Okay, Uku, I'm a beast. Obuehi, Ozan Nadiocha, Igweta of Oboro. Welcome, sir. Sir, so, your name, sir. My name is Israel Majesty. As the doctor, good luck will be. Justice of the Peace. Of four, Jim, Obudu Hiji of four, Oru West, local government of Yuma State. You're welcome to Zion for my name, sir. All right, so when you were coming, is this the first time coming here to this site? No. For me, no. Okay. It's not the first time I've been coming. Okay, sir. Sir. Is this the first time coming to this site? Is this is the first time coming to worship with them, but I've been around in the site before. Mm, how did you find the program, sir? Very wonderful. Okay. Before you started uh, following Zion Prayer Movement out in the ministry, when you started, what was your first impression like on Zion Ministry? Okay, my first impression was. Uh, a Messiah has come to Nigeria mm. in the likeness of uh, Evangelist Ibu Kobi. What we read in the Bible about St. Paul, Apostle Paul, and the mysteries behind him, we have got such thing in Nigeria. That, that was my impression because uh, uh, starting to read him, I read about his the miracles he performed, so many things. So my impression was is it possible what we read in the time of Apostle Paul mm. is here with us? That was my impression. What do you think the impact of Zion Ministry moving down to Kola will be for Imo State? It's going to bring a lot. Economically, spiritually, it's going to bring a lot. This area is going to develop physically, economically. And uh, I'm sure, spiritually, a lot of people will be more interested in the things of God because most of us believe when they see, and seeing, they say, is believing. When they come and see, they will believe. All right. So, what do you have to say about the prophet? Any character he has that you feel like people of, or people of uh, Lagos, Nigeria, and the world should emulate from your own point of view? Uh, well, um, he has so many characters of virtue. So many characters of virtue. But what I will pick, since you asked me for one, I will pick perseverance. Evangelist Ebuka Obi is very, very persistent and insistent. He perseveres to the last. Here is someone who will lie in stone to pray for days, months, and weeks, asking something from God. And he will not stop until God answers that prayer. It is a virtue of him among so many virtues that I appreciate, I appreciate persistence. How many people, how many men of God will take to that? 100 days fasting and prayers for him to achieve a purpose. I emulate such, though I'm yet to stand by it. I try my best along the line. I will be tempted. I will go back. But definitely, as time goes on, with time, with time All right. I will conquer. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Uh, what do you 